Hi Ronnie, Grass Valley is introducing a new camera platform, LEX100. What makes this new camera so interesting? Thank you Suzanne. Well, it's a very, very long list of new features. So it's all about live sports, live emotion in UHD and capturing every element in its full essence. It's a long list from its in-house developed imagers throughout the whole processing and all including native IP. Native IP? That sounds intriguing. Can you explain what you mean? So when you think about a complete installation, there are many boxes involved. And when you go to a full IP solution, even more boxes get involved. What we've done is basically we took all those ingredients and put it inside the camera itself. So you can get rid of the XU completely and make the camera talk IP. And this means that you can really scale everything. So you can scale up to whatever needs that you have. It also means you can orchestrate everything with GV Orbit instantaneously. And it also means that you are very, very flexible. So it also means that everybody can be much more creative because the equipment can be anywhere and you can stream it anywhere. So wherever the creative people are, they can collaborate. And since everything is built on open standards, so everything is built on SEMT 2110, it also means it plays very nice with all the other ingredients, of course, including Grass Valley's offerings. So native IP means I can connect a camera anywhere on my network and have it immediate recognized? Absolutely. It's fully based on open standards, including AMBA and MOS. So that means wherever you connect this camera in your infrastructure, it will show up and you can connect it with our tools. And there's even more flexibility to it. So if you take off this lid, you can change SFPs. And it means if you use it as an HD camera, you can just use a 10 gig SFP. For UHD single speed, of course, you need 25 gigabit per second. But if you go to triple speed UHD, even that isn't enough. And that's why we also have a QSFP slot right beyond this cover. And you can just use the fibers in this robust SEMTI hybrid fiber cable and connect it directly to a QSFP Close the lid and you're good to go. It is really exciting that LDX100 is looking to the future. But what if producers want UHD today but aren't ready for IP? Excellent point, Suzanne. So for those customers, we also added an additional gimmick. And that means this camera can be connected to an XEU UXF universe as well. And that gives you the connectivity to both baseband as well as IP and anything in between that. So if you're not ready for the full native IP today, you can just migrate at your own pace by using the XCU. And that gives you the full flexibility to seamlessly migrate from full baseband to full IP. And all these things, of course, are crucial when you talk about outside broadcast and live sports. You continue to emphasize outside broadcast and sports. Why do you need a camera that is specifically designed for live action? Well, in live action, we have the most critical use case. So there is no second chance for a first impression. So that also means that if you miss the moment, you've missed it completely and you cannot share it with the audience at home. So everything in this camera is about capturing the live action regardless of the situation or surrounding it. So we do that with our three in-house developed imagers, the brand new ones that go into this camera. And it's all about getting every single bit out of those images and using them to the fullest extent. So this means we can capture in full slow motion. That means we capture the red, green and blue of every single image in its full extent and its full dynamic. In addition, you can instantaneously switch between single speed and triple speed. So you really can use the camera to its fullest extent, depending on the situation of the game and its position. So the images we use work together with the B4 lens mount, the standard within broadcast. So that means you get a full zoom range, as well as the normal depth of field that you need for the storytelling in the game. In addition, we have a complete new optical design of the camera. And this gives you a very rich amount of vibrant colors, filling almost the complete white color gamut. Top that off with the HDR capabilities of the camera. That means you have native HLG, native PQ, as well as S-Log3. And it gives you the full set of ingredients to capture emotion in its fullest extent. It sounds like you have designed this camera for a new way of operating. Absolutely. So we work with professional operators worldwide with everything that we do. So this camera, again, is full of small gimmicks that really make operational use very easy. Oh, tell us more about it. So first of all, of course, if this camera is standalone without an XU, it's really important that you have all the diagnostics. So that's why on the back of the camera, we have six LEDs that at any moment in time give you all the instant diagnostics of your link. In addition, as the choice of lenses changes all the time, we now have the trend that lenses tend to get more and more wide angle. Well, 
as the camera gets less and less heavy all the time and lenses become more and more heavy, you of course need the ability to really get the right grip for any shot. And that's why, for instance, we have the ability now to change the hand grip position. So in a super expander, you take it in the most backward position, while if you have a very big lens, a heavy lens, you can slide it all the way forward and really have an optimal grip for long days. In addition, in the hand grip now, we have a zoom control on top that slides forward and backward. So I can make shots where I focus with one hand, have a low angle shot and zoom with the other one. So that means I'm completely all set with all the things I need to control instantaneously under all circumstances. That sounds like cause for celebration. Thanks for introducing to us this unique new camera. What do you want people to remember about the LDX100? Well, actually, it's quite a long list. So first of all, of course, native IP. It's based on all the open standards and it makes itself known in your ecosystem under all conditions straight away. Second of all, of course, the fact that you can use it as an HD camera, a UHD camera, and of course, even a triple speed UHD camera where it natively captures every part of the whole emotion. Then, of course, the new wide color gamut and the new HDR capabilities inside this camera, including even S-Log3, that makes it the ideal solution for capturing the reality of the broadcast event. And then, of course, you can connect an XCU to the camera as well, as well as native IP. So you can seamlessly migrate from baseband to IP. And then, of course, you can even change the SFPs in the model itself. So you even can migrate from 10 to 25 or even 100 gigabit per second straight away from the camera. And last but not least, the design is completely made from scratch. And we even made it champagne shower proof. <laughs> <laughs> Press the button below to make an appointment with your sales rep and we hope to see you soon at your premises. <laughs>